the body, gender, and identity. The body, gender, and identity theme I have chosen is particular in its own way because there's so much more than just the words itself. The body, gender, and identity can make up who an individual is. It can define and describe a person from both the inside and outside. It can label an individual for who they see themselves as and how they want others to see them. <clears throat> it's to investigate who someone is from the inside and how they choose to broadcast it to the society that they live in. Within the body, gender, and identity, there was pieces of artwork I found throughout my research paper. <clears throat> this leads to Cindy Sherman. Cindy Sherman was born January 19, 1954 in Glen Ridge, New Jersey. She is an American artist <clears throat> who focuses on the recognition of a person's thought, of a person through her artwork. <clears throat> the structure and type of artwork came from what she believed in and what she saw through her eyes in society. Cindy Sherman has been a well-known American artist throughout time and is one of the most significant artists of pictures generation. This leads to the art piece untitled number 96. <clears throat> Within this piece of artwork, that was painted in 1981, the symbols shown can express her feelings, the person's feelings. <clears throat> you clearly see that the woman is laying down, kind of distraught, sad, thinking, and <clears throat> the meaning behind all this is that there's so much more than what the picture gives off. You're seeing that her body is sad and is identified that something is wrong <clears throat> and she's in this distraught feeling. Obligation 2019 was painted by Eula Bayou in 2019. There's a lot of strong symbolism within this piece of artwork and what it shows is that <clears throat> A person can feel hidden within their body. You can see the extreme close-up that the picture symbolizes. And this person may feel like he can't truly be himself because they, they who are the people in society, can judge him for who he truly is. This artwork, this artwork shows no smile, smirk, happy facial expression, which means this boy is not liking how things are currently going for him. He looks like he's living in an uncomfortable life that he doesn't feel like he can change. <clears throat> within this, you can see that the identity part of the theme is within this artwork because he doesn't know how to express himself with the surroundings that he lives in. Next is the Untitled 2018 Painted in the year 2018 by artist Lashawn Chong. <clears throat> this portrait explores the emotions that are hidden. Symbolism. Loneliness. Within this picture, you can tell that this woman can't express her feelings out in public and feels like she is secluded to just feeling like this on her own. You can tell that her body is covered within this blanket she has this baggage on her, which symbolizes the rocks. The rocks symbolize the baggage, the stress, the worry, the crying, all the negativity that she's dealing with, and she's covering her feelings with that blanket because a woman in society can't show her emotion, and she has to show it behind closed doors, which makes her, which makes her feel lonely. I also did find some other pieces of artwork. For instance, this one shows the body. This artwork shows that people should not care what others think about their body and should just express themselves how they truly feel and want others to see them. The gender. This piece of artwork shows that a person can be born a male but want to become female or vice versa and how they choose to live their life and express their personality, who they truly are inside, 
is truly up to them and it shouldn't matter to anybody else. Leading to the identity. The identity of someone can only be seen through someone within themselves. It is a mask that people tend to wear because they're afraid to truly express themselves in the society that we live in.